Hey YouTube, Jim here. Welcome to Top 10 Archive. Space is vast, mysterious, and has the potential to be pretty terrifying. In fact, the thought of coming into contact with extraterrestrial life or getting lost in space is horrifying enough to have spawned hundreds of horror movies. But nothing is quite as scary as what actually lurks up there. Real space encounters are actually more unnerving than anything I've ever seen at the cinema. So today we're counting down the top 10 scariest sounds from space. But before we get started, why not become an archivist today by clicking that subscribe button and notification bell so you don't miss out on any future uploads. If you end up enjoying this video, let us know by giving it a thumbs up and in the comment section, Tell us if you believe there is intelligent life outside of our home planet. Number 10. Jupiter Radio Signals When the Cassini spacecraft embarked on its historic mission to Saturn, NASA was probably fairly certain it would capture some incredible sights and sounds, and it absolutely did. It saw a ginormous storm eight times the surface area of Earth and methane lakes on Titan Saturn's giant moon. The creepiest thing they captured was actually on Jupiter, where the spacecraft swung by to receive a gravitational boost to help it on its way to its final destination. Is it just me, or does this audio sound sort of like alien radio signals? These spooky sounds are actually just what Jupiter sounds like. Number 9. Earth Whistling Earth has its own sounds too, and they're equally as haunting as the noises we just heard from Jupiter. These creepy whistling noises were captured by NASA's Van Allen probes, which were designed to help scientists better understand space weather so that one day in the future it can be predicted before it affects Earth. The whistles are the result of plasma waves interacting with our planet's magnetic fields. Number 8. Plasma Hiss NASA's polar satellite was designed predominantly for climate and polar magnetosphere studies, but it proved itself equally as useful for capturing sounds to scare the life out of you. This sounds exactly like someone or something is breathing, doesn't it? Imagine being the scientist to pick up that alien-like sound for the first time. What we're actually listening to is the sound generated by hot, ionized particles that are generated by sunlight hitting the atmosphere. Put simply, it's the hiss of plasma that's going to give me nightmares tonight. Number 7. Mars Quake 2019 has been an exciting time for NASA's Mars InSight. For the first time ever, it's recorded what was likely a Mars quake. If you're wondering, a Mars quake is an earthquake, but on Mars. Faint seismic signals were detected in April, and they seem to be the first trembling noises to have come from the inside of the planet rather than surface noises like wind, which are much more common. If you've ever wondered what a Mars quake sounds like, it's actually pretty unnerving. That, dear viewers, is what Martian seismology sounds like. Number 6. Saturn Radio Emissions the Cassini spacecraft that picked up Jupiter's spooky radio waves also captured some creepy goings-on when it finally reached Saturn. What we're hearing are radio waves being emitted through a phenomenon that isn't too dissimilar to the one that creates auroras on Earth. That clip isn't even the spookiest bit. Listen to this section of the recording.
Is it just me? Or do those glitch noises sound like someone or something is trying to communicate with NASA? Number 5. Earth's Magnetic Drum This next clip is actually pretty cool. Did you know that our near-Earth environment is packed full of sounds that make up a sort of space orchestra? Electromagnetic waves traveling around our planet sound like string instruments. And we heard earlier in this video how Earth whistles. But scientists recently discovered that space really knows how to drop the beat. Is this proof of extraterrestrial activity? Does this show us that there might be an actual space band out there? Well, no. These otherworldly drum sounds are actually plasma jets striking the boundary of the protective magnetic bubble that surrounds Earth. Cool, huh? Number 4. Balloon Records Alien Sounds when a UNC graduate student sent a high-altitude balloon 22 miles or 35 kilometers above the Earth, they probably didn't expect to record such creepy sounds. The balloon was equipped with infrasound microphones, and it was those that picked up these super spooky noises. Many people speculated that the grad student had managed to capture audio proof of the existence of aliens, but NASA puts the sounds down to comparatively boring air turbulence. What do you think they are? Number 3. Singing Comet a singing comet probably sounds like something that would sound quite jolly, right? Wrong. It sounds pretty terrifying. Have a listen. The haunting song was discovered by the Rosetta Orbiter in 2014. The frequency of the recording has been increased by a factor of 10,000 because the original clip is way below a human's ability to hear. The comet responsible for the noise is called Comet 67P churyumov gerasiminko and is thought to be its magnetic field that's responsible for the scary sounds. Number 2. Jupiter's Bow Shock We're back to Jupiter now, and I'll warn you, this clip is especially creepy. Can you hear the whispering that the Voyager spacecraft captured? It sounds as though extraterrestrial beings are using these recordings to communicate, but it's actually something a lot less creepy. The haunting sounds are from a phenomenon known as bow shock. This occurs when the solar wind from the sun is repelled by a strong magnetic force from something such as a large planet. When the solar wind is deflected, its motion is converted into thermal energy, and it's this that we're hearing. Or maybe that's what they want us to believe. Number 1. Music from the Far Side of the Moon Fifty years ago, Apollo 10 traveled to the far side of the moon. While they were there, they lost all communication with Earth for around an hour. But it seems like something else was trying to communicate with them while they were around there. Listen to this fascinating yet horrifying clip. That didn't need to keep it sound out of space, did not it? Do you hear that? That whistling sound? Yeah. <laughs> This clip remained hidden for five decades before finally being released by NASA. Was NASA trying to hide something by burying the audio tapes? 
maybe because even some astronauts believe that the sound could have been down to something extraterrestrial. Al Warden, an Apollo 15 command module pilot, believes NASA might have kept this information away from the public for a reason. Thanks for watching and listening. I always thought the occasional ringing in my ears was aliens trying to communicate with me. People tell me there's certainly enough space in my head for that to happen. Hey, wait a minute. Oh well. Make some noise and leave your comments below and be sure to subscribe, give this video a like and click the bell so you'll know right away when new videos are released. Sounds right to me.